This is the new Orion Observer 90mm Refractor Telescope. It replaces the AstroView 90mm Refractor Telescope. And today, we just got it in the mail. I'm going to take a quick unboxing and assembly and take a look at it. Stay tuned. So this is a brand new Orion 90 millimeter refractor telescope, their new observer series. So I wanted to see how it stacks up to the last two models of this telescope they released that I already own. As most of y'all know, this is uh, one of my favorite beginner telescopes the ones from Orion. So I want to see if this one stacks up well against the other two. So it's double boxed. That's a good start. Instruction manual. This is one of the better instruction manuals that you will get with a telescope. It is 16 pages all in English. Plenty of pictures, diagrams, and out of those 16 pages, the back has the warranty and specifications. The front cover, of course, talks about the Observer Series. Then you have a little table of contents, and then it gets right into the meat of the story. So that's, that's nice. They're usually pretty good about the little details. So let's see here. Just a spacer. We've got All right, here's the optical tube. Not really what I wanted first, but okay. bag and then tissue paper probably to get it keep it from getting scratched flip that open okay I see some things I'm gonna have problems with already but let's get it started that on there just for right now keep it from rolling all right let's see what else we got bag of accessories i'll get to that here in just a minute just like the tripod Accessory or eyepiece tray. It's right there. A little bit different design for the eyepiece tray. You unscrew a little plastic bolt, slap that on, and screw that in. Okay. Looks like we have the mount. goes here assuming I twist it the right direction there we go Ooh. that's interesting there we go and there we go. Okay. Let's 
here we have slow motion control, we have the weight bar, and then we have slow motion control. And that means in this last box we should have the weights. Or the weight. Singular. same thing. All right, be careful at this point that you don't pull this threaded piece out all the way. Because if you do, there's a pin that goes in here. I hate that they started doing that, but Orion's not the only one who does that. So if you lose that pin, you're in a world of trouble. Not only that, but if you hold the weight with this up, the pin falls down so you can't put this in there it doesn't go so you have to hold it right stick that in and you can tighten this okay there's another thing i don't like right there but okay let's see here where are we there up there you screw it there come on All right, that goes there. We unscrew this big knob. And we should be able to slide this in there. Okay. These little guys unscrew them just enough to make that hole empty slide it in and tighten it on the flat spot and we do the same thing for this one slide it in tighten it on the flat spot slow motion controls all right then we'll check out our accessories What do we got here? We have the finder scope. Which goes turn this around. Right here you've got some uh, threaded bolts coming out of the telescope. Two nuts on the top. That just slides on there like that. That screw on there like that. And then let's see what else we got. Like we got three more things in the accessories bag. We have a diagonal. Which of course goes there. And then we have two eyepieces. We have a 25 millimeter puzzle which goes 
there. And then for higher powers, we have a smaller one. What is this? 10 millimeter. Which, oddly enough, is not actually marked as an Orion product. Is that one? No. All righty. And there you go.